Hey everybody, welcome back to a new course. Today we're looking at Periscope Producer, taking a look at setting up Periscope Producer using our streaming software, mainly Wirecast, but you could do this with OBS Project as well. I'm also going to be discussing the benefits of using Periscope compared to, say, using uh, YouTube or Facebook Live. We're also going to be looking at a screencast showing you how to actually set up in Wirecast the settings that you need for Periscope Producer and also in OBS Project, which is a free to download piece of software for Windows and Mac. I'm also going to be touching on lightly some ideas ideas for doing regular shows now you have access to periscope in a different way from the desktop you can do a lot more things you can do animation lower thirds you can have uh, playlists you can have different inputs it's not just you tied to your mobile smart device or most of the time your mobile phone also going to be discussing about ideas using rebrandly which is a service that i absolutely love which takes urls shortens them to a shorter link but having them in a short link format so that you can share them and remember them easily while you're doing your live stream so let's get into this